the whole Yosemite Valley was scoured out by melting ice. And so it's gonna carry boulders. And when the ice melts, the boulders don't, <laughs> so they stay behind. Evidence that there was an ice age. Well, now let's, let's look at clues in the Bible to tell us when that happened. Welcome to Creation on Location. Today, sunset at Yosemite National Park. And we're asking the question, was there really an ice age? And uh, what we're gonna do is we're gonna look at clues in the world. We're gonna look at clues in the Bible, the word, and we're gonna see that yes, there was an ice age. So the first clue is this big boulder. And we call this an erratic, E-R-R-A-T-I-C, erratic, because it is in a field, but it's rolled or it's moved or transported farther than it could have rolled had it just fallen off a cliff. It falls off a cliff, it lands at the foot of the cliff. But these erratic boulders are sometimes in the middle of a field. And it's like the old riddle. How did this land in the middle of the room? Well, it was in ice. So if you have ice carrying these boulders, you know, the whole Yosemite Valley was scoured out by melting ice. And so it's gonna carry boulders. And when the ice melts, the boulders don't, <laughs> so they stay behind. That's why we have erratics. So here's an example of an erratic boulder, uh, evidence that there was an ice age. Well, now let's look at clues in the Bible to tell us when that happened. And the first clue is in Genesis. It says that Abraham and Lot looked out over the Jordan River Valley, and Abraham said, you go where you wanna go. And what did it say? Lot saw that it was a well-watered land. Is it well-watered today? Not at all. But it was back then, during the Ice Age. So during the Ice Age, uh, it was a well-watered land in the Middle East, and this was a glacier here, because we're at high elevation in the Sierra Nevadas here in California. The Book of Job, contains events that occurred just a few generations after the flood, and it contains more frost-filled language than any other book in the Bible. Consider the following passages. Have you entered the treasury of snow, or have you seen the treasury of hail? From whose womb comes the ice, and the frost of heaven, who gives it birth? By the breath of God, ice is given, and the broad waters are frozen. So uh, Job was a, was a contemporary, roughly, uh, of Abraham's time. And uh, th this, that's the Ice Age. So we have Ice Age happening in the Bible after the flood, for hundreds of years after the flood. And that matches what we see in the rocks that show that, hey, the Bible got it right. It has clues about the Ice Age. There really was an Ice Age. And yes, the Ice Age fits right in with Genesis history just thousands of years ago. 